guys, Duran slash Learn Swain here, and what you are looking at right now is the main menu for a Pong game I made for LOS. It, the menu is, isn't very polished or pretty, but it does work. It also shows new GUI elements, like radio buttons, which you can only select one of, and tick boxes. You can't really see it well in the video. You don't even need to click on the ticks, you can click on the text somewhere. So yeah. So the basic idea of the Pong game is you may know when you push the start button you get this little panel and you bounce this little ball around and eventually you'll miss the ball and just game over screen and your score. The score is how many times the ball has hit your paddle. Now these here are for different game modes. You have survival mode, which the wall comes closer. On the right, there's a wall on the right that sort of comes closer when you're playing. A shrinking panel, the panel becomes smaller on every point you make. And unpredictable, the ball bounces against everything in any direction, you have no idea. So let's turn them all on, show you what kind of chaos this game can do. See this, um, that's unpredictable right now, it's pretty clear. And yeah, I hate unpredictable modes, so we're gonna turn that off. Let's turn on these, oh. these, keep it on a big panel. The shrinking pedal isn't very easy to see. Oh, come on. I suck at this game. <laughs> Score zero. Level mode, shrinking pedal. The shrinking pedal isn't very easy to see because it only shrinks by one every time. Otherwise, the pedal shrinks way too fast and you have no way to get a high, higher high score. Just remember what the pedal looks like right now. And on every hit, it'll become a slight, tiny bit smaller. Yeah, now it's quite small. It's there. I'm not sitting in a very comfortable place to play pawn nests as well. And oh, the pole's getting bigger than the paddle. What the? Oh, darn. Score twenty one. Not bad for a panel, it's almost the smallest of all. But uh, yeah, that's it. You can combine modes or only choose one of them. So you choose unpredictable only the small panel, which isn't that small, but small panel nonetheless. What? You may notice it's flickering a bit, that's because there's no frame buffer on LOS and whatnot. It is running really smoothly though, besides that. Yeah. See, unpredictable mode makes absolutely no sense. It just uses a random number from 1 to 3. Absolutely no care for the laws of physics. Well, talk about not caring about the laws of physics. It appears I broke it. Yeah, it's not bug free. I haven't tested it much, but as is pretty clear, I have absolutely no idea what's happening. Um, okay, so that's it. Thanks for watching. I uh, hope you liked it and such. Um, yeah, bye.